The Arkansas State men's track and field team started the first day early with the heptathlon. They got off to a good start with this event when both ASU athletes were placed second and third after day one. After a rough first day for other ASU athletes, the Red Wolves were behind the pace they needed to keep in order to be back-to-back -back champions. But the team wasn't going to go down without a fight. Left, so I think our chances are still pretty good. Uh, last year was my first championship in my life, so that meant a whole lot to me. So if I could do that again, it would be amazing. The Red Wolves had a nice outing on the final day of competition, finishing with one gold medal, six silver medals, and four bronze medals. ASU finished second overall, ten and a half points behind UT Arlington. The team, however, is still hopeful about what the outdoor season has to bring. Like I said, we're extremely persevering. So, I mean, like I said, every time we're getting hurt, every time there's a setback, they're always working towards the next goal, the next step. So, we're working hard, really excellent. I think the main thing is just staying healthy and uh, staying personal uh, towards our goal, and uh, I think we got a really good chance. But, the Red Wolves will be hosting the Sunbelt Outdoor Conference Championship for the first time since joining the conference back in 1991. The ASU men's team will be looking to go back to back after winning the competition last year and earn their fifth Outdoor Conference title. Reporting for ASU TV, I'm Dalton Romero.